Ahoy hoy everyone and bright suns. It's Craig here coming to you from Black Spire Outpost on the Planet Batu for another Disney dining review. Before we get started, I want to remind you that this is brought to you by Dreams Unlimited Travel. If you like our content and you want to support us, please consider booking your vacation through Dreams Unlimited Travel. It costs you no extra money and you get the support of an amazing Dreams Unlimited Travel agent. So head over to dreamsunlimitedtravel.com today for a free no obligation quote. Now what brings me to Black Spire Outpost today? Well, it's for a review that I don't believe I've ever done before. I've had this food item before, but I've never done a proper review for it. And this is the Ronto Morning Wrap. It is $12.49 and it is that grilled pork sausage that we know and love from a Ronto Wrap, wrapped up in an egg omelet that also has shredded cheddar cheese, the peppercorn sauce, and then it's all located right in the pita. And you know me, or you don't, but I'll just go ahead and say it. Ronto wraps are probably my favorite thing to eat in this park, and it's my favorite thing to eat in all of Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. And anytime I've had this one in the past, I haven't really enjoyed it that much. It just felt like something was lacking, whether it's like the crunch you get from the normal Ronto wrap with the uh, with the slaw that's on there, or, you know, usually a lack of peppercorn sauce is what my complaint is. But going in this with this one and uh, hoping for the best. So here goes nothing. I'm a few bites in and I have to say I'm actually really enjoying it. I think that the the balance of this one is actually really well done and I haven't had any major complaints so far with the first couple bites I took. I know it's going to get a little bad here at the end as it starts to get to a section that was burnt but we'll save that problem for later obviously. But yeah, everything's everything's working with it. The sausage is grilled perfectly. It is juicy. It is dominating the flavor, which I'm completely okay with. The eggs are entirely bland. I mean, really, the eggs, take them or leave them. I, I know it makes it a breakfast sandwich once you add the eggs in, but this is where I get kind of loose with it. Like, you know what, just trade out the eggs for the extra pork and have a regular Ronto wrap. But I, I get it too. It might be too much meat for some people. Uh, the cheese, I could use a little bit more cheese and I could definitely use way more of the peppercorn sauce. I almost wish that the peppercorn sauce came on the side and you could just, you know, dip it in there as much as you want. I'm sure it's really bad for you, but I'd, uh, it adds that peppery zing to this entire thing uh, on top of the, you know, the spiciness of the linguisa pork sausage. So I, I still got more to eat here. So let me take a few more bites. Maybe I'll just wrap it up and then let you know my final thoughts. We'll have to see where it goes. I'm basically on my last bite or two. So I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this up and say that I did enjoy this enough that I would recommend it for breakfast. Like I still would recommend the regular Ronto wrap over this one any day of the week. I would even say if you're not like bent on having a breakfast sandwich, then just get the regular Ronto wrap even for breakfast. They're serving it then too. But if you're the type of person that you need to start your day with breakfast and you can't have, you know, something something that's like lunch related for breakfast, then I think this is a good option. I would rather have this than just like an egg and cheese sandwich from somewhere else. Feels a little bit more elevated, feels more unique because of the style to, you know, other places you get an egg sandwich, maybe you get a side with it. But honestly, for a grab and go snack, I think it's the perfect size. It's really filling, maybe too filling for some in the morning but I like, I like a lot of food in the morning, so this works for me. It's just, it's a perfect amount. Again, my only complaints could use, you know, the eggs could use a little more seasoning, could use a little more cheese, and I would love to have more peppercorn sauce, but overall, it's a solid breakfast sandwich. But I still like the regular Ronto wrap better. And with that, it's gonna do it for this Disney dining review. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit the thumbs up subscribe to the channel and leave any comments, questions, or video suggestions in the comments section below. And if you want to support us even more, you can always book a trip through Dreams Unlimited Travel. Get a free no obligation quote today at dreamsunlimitedtravel.com. That's going to do it for me though here at Disney's Hollywood Studios. I'll see you again real soon with another Disney dining review. Take care. Bye-bye.